All right, what a beautiful new day. In the last video, we built a resource storage and we also built a food shed, a food storage. And we also built a barn and planted some cabbage. The cabbage grew in one season and that's this is just the remnants of that. Uh, we also built some extra houses. This kind of happened off camera just because the footage was rainy and it was dark and it was just a lot. My guy looks extremely dirty right now. Uh, but we have four extra houses. These house three, those over there house four. Um, before we do anything, we're going to split up our settlers because I don't want anybody having a baby anytime soon. Alright, now we've got all of our settlers split up so nobody's going to get married and have a kid. Uh, whenever your settlers have babies, it will put the, the lady, whatever she's doing, whatever her task is in your town, she'll be out of the task for, I believe, 17 to 18 years. I honestly don't know what the exact number is, but you will be down a worker for 18 years, and that kid won't be able to do anything for 18 years. Meaning, you know, for the entirety of my life, almost, I'll be like, this character will be 48 by the time we have, well, I guess it's only, he's only 18 now, so he'll be in his 30s before that lady will become available again. Let's check out these skills right here too. We've got survival. Edwin. How can hello. I help you? Uh, hi. Whatever you need. I've got it. You do? Okay, I need fertilizer. Let's get some fertilizer. So it would technically be cheaper to buy 30 of these and make the fertilizer ourselves, which we can totally do. So we'll buy some manure. And I think that's all we need at the moment. Have a good day. That's all I really came over here for. I would have liked to pick up a settler, but there's nobody here worthy of being in this settlement. First, we need to turn this manure into fertilizer. We're gonna go over to this workbench and you have to... Fertilizer, okay, good. I was gonna say, can I not do it? You're gonna have to craft the fertilizer yourself. You can eventually assign settlers to work here at the barn and craft the fertilizer. It will happen very slowly over time and it's not something that you're gonna have like 15 fertilizer every single time. If you want your own fertilizer you're gonna need to set up an animal husbandry which is to have your own animals. I go ahead and pull out this simple bag and we're gonna Put manure, we've got 15, not manure, sorry, fertilizer. And go ahead and re-fertilize this field. All right, that is all of our fertilizer used. We also got a level in farming, which we're going to use. Farming knowledge, yes. We also have a survivor skill. Let's do athlete, 20% lower stamina consumption while moving, while moving, while moving. Uh, now we need to go make a knife because if you can see in the top left hand corner our people are out of a tool and that's probably what it is, is a knife. Look at our nice little settlement back there. Just hanging out by the riverside right next to Gustovia. I can't wait to actually like explore a little bit. It's gonna be really cool. These stone knives are going to be used an incredible amount because this is pretty much how you're going to be gathering food for the majority of the game is with a stone knife and oh I got a kitchen and a, and a fishing spear whatever I was saying alright let's uh, go and put these stone knives in here so that they stop complaining normally you would put the knives in the actual shop but because we have this resource storage we can actually just put the knives in here and that should cover it yep all right go ahead and replow this field and then we're gonna sow in some fertilize uh wheat seeds 
And it's gonna suck if we need leather, because I don't know if we have leather right now. I just sold it all. Alright, let's go and see how much leather we have. Which all we need is three. That'll be that'll be enough. And look at that, we have three. We're gonna craft another simple bag. And you know, I actually think I have the wheat grain in here too. I do. Alright, now we have the wheat grain. We're gonna pull out the simple bag. Gonna pick wheat. Oh, that's rye. No, we're gonna pick wheat. And we're gonna plant the wheat. And the wheat will take winter to grow, and I'm pretty sure it'll grow in spring. I really hope it does. We're gonna end up building a ton of farming spots. It's gonna be like how we play our game for the most part, how you make a lot of money. We got a ton of cabbage already. The kitchen's gonna be clutch. It'll be our 15th building. I really wanted the workshop. Not the workshop, the smithy. Smithy makes life a lot easier. Perfect! Broke right on the last one. We're gonna just grab all these sticks and turn them into wick, wicker baskets. I have enough money. And we're gonna go get more money. It's gonna be our main focus for this moment, is money. Which, we're not gonna be able to get that much, but we can do our best. Probably gonna get like two or 300 coins from this. It's gonna cost 50 to start this. We'll pretty much be free. And then we might run over and grab a bow. That's like the whole purpose behind this is to go get a bow. And bows are expensive. Alright, so you can come over here to the workshop. We can go to wooden and wicker. And I'm pretty sure this one's 50 small wicker basket. But we're gonna buy this. And we're also gonna buy the bowls. Because the bowls will be very, very useful. Uh, now we're gonna craft as many of these wicker baskets as possible. Which, at the moment, it's gonna be 20. Alright, now we have 20 wicker baskets, and we're going to go sell them. In winter, we don't have clothing. Winter is the next season. And we do not have clothing to survive. Uh, that's okay, because you can still survive winter without having the correct clothing. It's just going to cost torches, and you're going to have to hold a torch in your hand practically the entire winter. How are you? It is brutal. Best goods in the valley. Uh, we're gonna, what were we selling? Oh yeah, wicker baskets. Getting 150 coins for that. Nice. I Goodbye. think that's alright. Um, now, let's see, is this the same lady from before? Yes. And we don't want her because all of her skills suck. I guess so that we can finish this last quest up here, build at least 15 buildings, the building can be the kitchen. Alright, kitchen. Where 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 would I be if I was a kitchen? Alright, so I like it right about there. Okay, and we need eight stones and the cycle begins again. Alright, my guy is now starving. It's okay. This is gonna be a thing at the end of the seasons. Wants us to go get a bow and hunt a moose and a Winston, which is like an ox and a bear. That sounds like fun. Now we have all of our houses built. We have a kitchen built. Now we just need settlers. That's literally all we need. Um, my guy is dying of starvation right now. He's dying pretty quick. I still have food in my inventory. <laughs> Alright, just be careful when you're doing that. Don't let your character die. It's not good. I'm just scared of traveling right now, because if I run into a wolf or anything like that, I am dead. 
like sticks like a good patron. All these houses with no settlers. Oh wait, you know what? I forget. There's a little town over here. Let's see if we can go get someone from over here. Oh, a new building, Herbalist Hut. That's nice. The Herbalist Hut will allow you to set a settler to collect like mushrooms and herbs and stuff like that. And they'll even make potions. So you can have like healing potions and stamina potions. It's great. We got some people over here. Hello! We got a lot of people over here. Okay. Let's see your skills. Oh, wait. Gotta wait for my stamina to come back. Alright. Alright, I don't really like any of those guys. That guy is it. Absolutely no. That's a bummer. Nobody here with really good skills. How far is the nearest village? It's not that far. We can we can run. How much food do I have? You know what? I'm actually not going to risk it. It's going to be annoying if I die. Oh, look, a chicken. Chicken coop. I can buy hens. I can buy the chick. This will be good. You know, I think that that's something that I want to try and get up to is an animal husbandry. I think that that would be nice. I don't know if chickens will have, like, manure or anything. I doubt it, but definitely think that having just eggs coming out of nowhere is really good. And if they have babies, you can sell them. Sell the animals. What are we? What else do we need in order to unlock this stuff? Let's see. Animal husbandry. Chicken. I just need more farming. More farming. Okay, herd. Let's go ahead and put another field down. That's what we'll do before the next season. Put some more fields down. Just kind of plot out an area for that. We've got one little field right here, but I think I want to go all the way up this side. I want to build the field as big as it will go. Go here. Start it right here. And let's just run up the hill. Size limit reached. Fifteen. There are obstacles. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna build one just like that. That looks pretty giant. Oh yeah, that looks giant. That's gonna be one giant field. We'll put another one right here too, because why not? Let's just do a 10 by 10. I feel like that's probably a little bit more sane. Alright, so now I've got two giant fields set up. And I don't really want to plow that. <laughs> it's gonna take a long time. Uh, we're gonna have to make some more stuff. Let's see, buildings, handcrafting. What do I need for hose? Alright, let's make a few hose and we'll just we'll just do that, because I'm pretty sure it'll give us a lot of farming XP, which is gonna be clutch. We need some logs. We'll grab two logs, because I'm pretty sure we're gonna need more than one hoe. Wooden hoe. Um, craft more. All right. All right. Well, it looks like we have a lot of uh, hoeing to do, and it begins. I'm not gonna have enough fertilizer to uh, do anything with these fields for a, a decent amount of time. So we have got a lot of farming space. Are we ever going to fill it all in? I hope so. We're definitely going to need to get our own animals. And we're going to, like, we're, this is going to be a monumental task. Maybe I don't know what I was doing. Oh, I forgot. Oh my goodness. Hold on, wait. Yeah, it says the tax on that? Oh, I guess it's not that bad. Yeah, it said the taxes on it are gonna be huge. Alright, so I guess we can just get rid of this other field. 
because I don't want to be paying taxes on something that I can't even can't even do. Maybe this whole I field thing was a bad idea. I don't even know. We're just gonna go with one and see what happens. It's getting late. Gonna be hitting the hay soon. I guess in this game that actually means something. All right, as you can see, I'm about to starve and dehydrate to death. There's already a lady in this bed. Let's go to my house and we'll sleep in the bed. Go into the next season, go into winter. Oh, a traveling merchant. He presents you his wares and tells you stories about faraway lands he saw. For a proper price, he could teach you a few tricks about haggling. Um, sure. 200 coins, 500 experience in diplomacy. Cool. Does that give me a level? Better. Awesome. Diplomatic knowledge. 10% better selling and buying prices. I definitely want that. All right, we're gonna just put it in there. Oh, I got two, what? All right, we're gonna put one in there too as well. Cool. All right, now it's winter and it's cold. And the wheat is growing. I hope it grows next season. I almost finished plowing this, but as you can see, my guy is shivering. There's only one way to fix that. How do I pull out the torch? There we go. Holding the torch is going to be the only thing that stops your person from dying. I built like four or five campfires and stood in, a, in his... Oh. Uh, clothing. Sitting by the fire. Okay. Alright, I think we're going to run to another town now and try and buy a bow. How much money do I have? I spent 200 on trying to talk to that guy. Alright, we're going to take some stuff with us to try and sell. Alright, now we are on our way to try and find a bow. I'm pretty sure that there's a dude in this place right here. Tutiki. And that's where we're going. Hey, look, I found a torch. How lucky can you get? Got a plank and a stone axe. I don't really care too much about the plank. I'm just going to leave it there. Alright, those feathers are going to come in handy. We got another torch. Looks like this game is loving me. Oh, look, there's a couple arrows. But iron arrow, nice. And we've got a plum wine, which is going to be worth a lot of money. See, this is why exploring is good. Find good stuff. Just gonna run around the long way. Oh look, there's another little thing for us to go through. Oh, let's go find another torch. Oh, what is this? A bronze axe, nice. Take, I'll take some firewood. Maybe too heavy to say. All right, sweet. We got a bronze axe. That is going to be so helpful. Got another fallen carriage over here. Looks like it's got some decent stuff. Got a torch, tin ore, copper ore, copper ore, stone pickaxe, tin ore, tin ore. Nice. That's actually all really good stuff. All right, I think that we are here. There's also potential settlers that we could bring back to the settlement. I'm just super excited. Oh, okay, okay. Look, someone's excited to see me. Um, do y'all have a bow and arrow person over here? Best goods in the valley. A newcomer. Hello there. Where can I find vendors? Hunting hunter. And okay, th thank you. Have That's a good all day. I wanted to know. So there there he is here somewhere. Let's go see what these people have to offer. Three farming. That's great. We're probably going to pick her up. 
Yeah, I like this. I like this lady. How old Hello, are you? Friend. 27. I, I can take 27. Perfect. Uh, now we need to give her a house. Just like everybody else, we're gonna give her her own house. Alright, now she has her own house. Everything's gonna be quenched immediately. I don't understand why I don't see this other vendor. Oh! Bless you. Oh, great. Let's run. Let's run down there. Hey, maybe we'll find more stuff. This could go very well. And I did find a bunch of torches, so it could go extremely well. Oh, look at that. A wool fabric. That's going to be clutch. Bronze shearing scissors. We're not going to need that anytime soon. I mean, this game takes a while to get built up. I don't really know how fast you should be going. I'm just kind of like rushing it because I enjoy that kind of stuff. I just want to see what the game has to offer. But you should really just be taking your time. Oh no, we've got an overturned carriage. What goodies do we have? A water skin. That's nice. What is this? A cudgel. Don't really care about Iron knife. Bronze bolt. Another wool fabric. Sweet. Oh, look at this. This is a, a bandit camp. I'm just going to run by it and hopefully no bandits come out and attack us because that would suck. They've got an iron axe, which is extremely clutch. I am overweight. Let's see, what can I get rid of? Alright, that helped out a little bit. I think we're over... It's right over the hill. Hello, good people of... La Seneca. Get out of here, bird. Get out of here. I have... Oh, there's a hunter here. I have come to speak with you, Mr. Hunter. You have something that I want. Hopefully. Hello, Trevor. My wares never disappoint. Oh, yes. For, oh, my goodness. It's expensive. 45 damage. Longbow is 55 damage. What is this? 35 damage? Yeah, we're definitely going to try and do something better than that. You know, it's going to be a while until we get wool. So we're going to go ahead and just sell these shears. We're also going to sell all this fur. We're going to sell the... No, we're going to keep the feather so we can make arrows when we get back. Sell the leather. Sell the wine. We got some rot. We can turn that into fertilizer. Wool fabric is expensive too. Nice. I think that that's all I'm willing to sell at the moment. What bow should I buy? Do they have a crossbow? I don't even think I can make bolts for that yet, so let's see. Recurve bow. I like the 55 damage. Definitely picking that up. Whatever you uh, need. Do you sell I've arrows? Got it. Yeah, but they're super expensive. Let's just buy ten. No, we're gonna have to buy the scheme. Let's see if we can. Have a good day. Let's see if we have to buy the scheme first. How much does that cost? It's right here. Uh, hunting lodge. Stone arrow is fifty. We're also gonna buy animal feed because I really want to unlock that. I want to get that hen house going. That's gonna be cool. All right, now we have a bow. Just up here, can I steal that? Nope. What do you have in your chest? Nothing? Okay. Oh, I lost some Dynasty Rep for that. I'm sorry. I was just looking. Jeez. Let's see what we got here. Still, crap people. Why is everybody so crap? I mean, two isn't that bad, but... We're just gonna wait until we find some good people. Yeah, I still have a lady that's not even doing anything. She has no job. Where do we want her to work? We want her to work in the kitchen. And now we need to make our way back to Gustovia. How much does it cost to get over there? 470, I can't even afford it. 
Bye. Let's equip our new bow. And the arrows, so that we don't accidentally run into somebody without them equipped, because that would suck. We just have the sto uh, iron arrows equipped for right now. We need to make it back to Gastovia. Oh my goodness, it's pretty far. And off we go. Oh, sweet, more arrows. Wow, I just found a bow for free. How great. Well, we might as well run through this town since it's on the way. Boo! Run! Run, dear, run! That's what I thought. Better be scared. Hello, good people of... Denica. There's a lot of people here. Oh, nice. That's a, that's a good hunter right there. Um, yeah, nobody else that I really want, necessarily. I mean, this guy's hunting skills are good. There's still no good farmers. We can, we can take our time. We don't have to rush anything. What do they sell here? Oh, they sell, they sell cloth. They sell clothing. Hi. Oh my goodness. All this stuff is so expensive. Dude, look at that, holy cow. I can't afford any of this. Simple backpack three. Oh my goodness, I want that so bad. What can I sell? We're gonna sell this bronze bolt. We're gonna sell these feathers. I want that backpack really bad. We're gonna sell this bow. What is the backpack? 364? Simple 532, jeez. I mean, if we can just get that first one, I'll be happy. And sell all this meat. What do we need? 364. Ah, mm. uh, what do I feel like getting rid of? Stone pickaxe. I'm gonna have to sell this. Oh, I could just sell this bronze axe. And we can sell the bow. Let's see if we can get all the way up. To the top, iron axe, iron knife. I don't want to sell those, those are really good. Um, what do I need for the simple big one? Let's see 532. I'm at 473. Let's Stranger. Uh, have a good day. Let's go and uh, cut down a tree and make a few spears, and then we can sell those. Lady, where'd you go? Please come back. I want you, I want your backpack. Oh my gosh, I'm so close. We could just sell one of these. We'll just sell this stone axe and this stone knife. Why not? All right, we want the simple large backpack. Yes. Yes. Goodbye. Let's put this puppy on. Oh yes, we have now got a massive backpack. I am so happy, I can carry 55 instead of 30, this is so nice. Yeah, come at me now, carry weight. You got nothing on me. Just double checking these people. Yeah, I don't want any of them. Well, what a successful run we just had. We got a bow, we got a backpack, Oh, look at uh, the thingy. What you got over here? A water skin. Got a stone knife that I just sold. So I got one back. Fur. What is this? Leather. Cool. Pull that torch out before I start dying. This backpack is going to make life so much easier. Oh, look. There's a, there's a bird over there. And I can't shoot for butt. Wow, okay. All right, can I get another chance, please? Is there another bird anywhere? Redemption. Oh my goodness, am I shooting over or what? All right, all right, all right. Just give me one more chance. 
One more chance, game. Oh, look, here we got another chance. Let's put it in first person, see if I can do any better. I got one! I finally got one. How many feathers you got? 30 feathers. That is a, a ton of feathers. Oh, what do we, what do we got over here? We got a water skin, we got mead. Got a stone axe that I probably need, and some logs. You know what, I can actually take these because my carry weight is so high. It's epic. What a successful day. Take this plank too. Give me that. And we've made it back. We're back, people. We're back. Papa's back. Look at this bird. Thinking he can just stroll on my turf like that. Get out of the way. I'm trying to shoot this bird. But I can't! Wow, I suck. Alright, we have survived our first day of winter. We got a bow. We got a backpack. We're gonna build a hen house in the next video. And when we come back tomorrow, we're gonna build the hen house. And hopefully do something about this huge farm. But I still haven't finished plowing. Not grubbed. Yeah, I still have to finish that too. I don't think I can plant anything in winter, can I? I can plant carrots in the winter. Dang. Let's go get some carrots. <laughs> Alright. See you guys in the next one.